Whoever coined the phrase Mysteries of the Orient must have had the martial arts in mind. The subtle differences between karate and taekwondo escape most of us, but this group of devotees knew exactly where to get their kicks from. They were privileged to witness a true master at work. For Master Toddy, one of the world's great Thai boxing teachers, had taken leave of his Manchester Academy to give a rare demonstration. He trained actually in the Orient from being six years old. He's only been in this country ten years. He's a world Thai boxing master and also a sixth degree black belt in Taekwondo. And uh, he's just the best, you know. He's, he's trained, since being to this country, he's trained seven English people into being seven, like so, seven world champions. To an outsider, it might seem strange to bow to your opponent before trying to kick and punch him or her into submission. But ritual plays a big part in all forms of Far East fighting. And you're on a horse ready to jump, feel ready to jump. Don't have to jump, but feel. That's it. Your hand ready to fight. Actually, they're wondering why I had to keep discipline and a lot of bowing and respect. But I explained to them, it's martial art. It's been over 2,000 years old. And it runs through the generation. And I've been teached like this, and I will continue to you and to and I want you to continue traditional so we don't destroy the traditional unlike most forms of karate Thai boxing is a full contact sport with opponents allowed to punch kick knee or elbow each other Master Toddy's skill and him a part in the Bond film the man with the golden gun the vast majority of his followers though have no interest in fighting for titles and Thai boxing is the ultimate self-defense because there is only about 20 basic moves in it you know, you go to some forms of Kung Fu and Karate and that, people have to train for sort of years before they could go out on the street and feel comfortable. With Thai boxing, within about three or four months, people find that they're quite able to look after themselves. With street crime on the increase, more and more women are turning to the martial arts. A well-aimed blow is the perfect antidote to unwelcome attention. The way the city is at the moment, you know, all over the country, actually, I think it's a good thing that women should know and I think it'd be a good idea for sort of basic self-defense to be taught in a lot of schools also. I mean the cowboy to attack people in the street. Mm. They will look at you first thing, you say. You not look like a fighter. Mm. You not look like a go to fight me back mm. and they attack you. That's why a lot of nice people uh, have to learn how to defend themselves properly. Remember, there's a feast of conventional boxing on ITV this weekend. De Dennis Andrews tomorrow night, Mike Tyson on Sunday morning. We leave you, though, with Master Toddy's style. <laughs>